Now, CBS4 Weather with meteorologist Lisette Gonzalez. Welcome to Wednesday. Thanks for weather watcher Marsha Axelrod for sharing this beautiful view from Aventura. She says she's noticing lots of clouds, which you can obviously see here. If you want to send your sunrise photos, I'd love to see the view from your neighborhood. Send them to CBS 4 Picks at CBS. Com. Here's another view courtesy of Standard K Booth. We're seeing that pretty pink sky off in the distance here in Lauderdale by the sea. And there is a view from our Rusty Pelican camera. And indeed, there are some clouds around, but thankfully, we're not dealing with any rain. And also looking at these overcast skies from Key West, as right now the radar is quiet. You don't have to worry about the windshield wipers or the wet weather gear just yet. The breeze is out of the east, 9 to 10 miles an hour. Temperatures comfortable in the low to mid 70s. And Broward and Dade, upper 70s down through the Keys, and we've been seeing the warmth across much of the eastern half of the country. So yeah, right now we're seeing the 70s and 60s across the southeast into Texas, the 50s up through New York and Boston, yet 30s in Minneapolis and Denver and 40s for much of the western half of the U.S., except for on the west coast in California, the 50s there, 40s in the Pacific Northwest. And along this front, there is some active weather and the, pro the pop possibility, I was going to say the probability of severe weather across the central and southern U.S. and parts of the Midwest and the Great Lakes and Northeast dealing with some rain too. But we are going to continue with the mainly dry weather pattern today. The rain chance is slim to none. If anything, there may be an isolated sprinkle on that breeze out of the east and the highs will warm to the low to mid 80s this afternoon. Hey, boaters, heads up. Small craft should still exercise caution. Winds out of the east, about 10 to 15 knots, a moderate chop on the base seas due to four up to five feet occasionally and a dangerous high risk of recurrence at the beach you're going to see those red flags flying so that means that you don't want to go swimming in the ocean it's not safe and the uv index is very high tonight lows will be in the low 70s partly cloudy with that light breeze still with us a lot of red on this map indicating the moisture and that means dry air that is going to stick around throughout the day today but as we head into your thursday notice how we see some green creeping in and that is that moisture that could lead to a few showers, maybe a few storms tomorrow, but really the rain chance will be highest heading into Friday, especially Saturday, Sunday, and even Monday because a front, a weak one, is going to likely just hang out to our north and not clear our area. 86 tomorrow, 88 on Friday, 90 on Saturday. It's going to feel summery for this weekend again.